All right, so Mr. Filament got a facelift. Uh, I had some spray paint, decided to give him a colorful rainbow. Uh, for those who are unaware, Mr. Filament is a combination of a Philistruder. This is the Philistruder. It's basically uh, a, a hot pipe with uh, an auger bit that pushes plastic down to the nozzle, or die as they call it. That's heated up so the plastic melts on its way down to that and then comes out in a string. And I control the uh, diameter of that with temperature. Uh, gravity is doing the pulling that stretches it slightly. Uh, so as it comes out, and, and this is a fume extraction unit because the ABS plastic that I'm currently extruding has fumes that I don't want to breathe in. So it's drawing air out through that tube. And then I've got another fan down there pushing more air out at that end. This contraption is a hopper system for the raw material that's ground up print waste basically. Uh, this auger basically helps push the material down through this tube into the pipe itself that the philostruder is then pushing the material through. So this is an auger assisted hopper to help the material get into the philostruder. The philostruder pushes it out and this is a system of conduit basically to, to keep the fumes from getting out into the air that I breathe. And the filament comes out there and by this time it's fairly cool uh, and then it passes through this laser sensor that detects how high it is or low and when it's low this winder which is a modified filler winder slowly winds up a little filament so as you can see it's moving there little by little winding up small lengths of filament so that it stays within this laser sensor area and if for some reason the extruder slows down and it's not uh, extruding the filament very quickly then it'll be up above the laser and the filler winder won't wind it right so it it only winds when it needs to wind which is what that laser is for and eventually this will be a spool with a whole bunch of uh, ABS printer filament which I reclaimed from old printer filament spools in fact Everything that's in there right now is ground up spools, which I believed, I tested and, and believed them to be ABS material that I can then uh, turn into ABS filament. And all this put together I call Mr. Filament. Uh, so if you have any questions on this, feel free to post or whatever, or private message if you want to. And uh, yeah, so this is what I'm turning all this into. This is... This is PLA scrap, and eventually this will get ground up and put through this machine and turned into PLA filament. And I have bins and bins full of color-separated PLA ready for me to grind up. And I have bags and bags of already ground up PETG filament in various colors. I did that a while ago, and I'll be doing that next through the machine. But first, I'm doing all the ABS that I have. And then, uh, yeah, that's it. Got some more filament coming. Thanks for watching.